So I've seen a lot of videos on how to get uh, Wi-Fi to your outbuilding. And uh, most of them center around a, a range extender or uh, some other sort of device that's trying to extend the Wi-Fi itself. I've got a solution that I used in my house that uh, worked really well, was cheap, was easy. And the key is right here that you've got a common power source. So what I've got here is obviously the transformer coming to my property and then uh, three panels, two of which go to the house and the third one goes here to my shed. Um, so that's the key is that you have a common power source that can take your uh, Wi-Fi adapter, it's called a power line adapter, from your house, I'll plug it into a wall outlet, comes in from the house to these panels, and they're all connected together, goes to this panel, which goes to my shed. And I'll show you what it looks like in here. You just take the other, it comes with two devices, one end you plug in an outlet in your house, one end you plug into an outlet in your outbuilding, and uh, so all I did here, I just mounted it right here. This is it. So I've got one of these in the house. All it is, you plug it in in the back and uh, plug the other end into, I've just got a little cheapo router up here. Uh, the one in the house obviously has a plug in to the outlet and then a ethernet adapter as well that uh, plugs into the to the router on the inside so anyway uh, it works real slick you don't get the fastest service but uh you know i'll be out here working on things and pulling up youtube videos and has absolutely no problem um playing videos at all um i would i think i was seeing three megabits per second download speed out here which is perfectly fine for video speed. Uh, the other thing that I learned is that you can't plug it into a, um, a surge suppressor or any device that um, suppresses a surge. So you can't plug it into something like this. So uh, there is a little risk there that if you get a surge, you're gonna lose your, lose your adapters. But again, I think I got it for 20 bucks. Um, and it, what is it? It's a D-Link. There's a model number right there. So anyway, just a simple solution if you guys are looking for one for uh, Wi-Fi to your outbuilding.